Hello Bloggineers, today we're going to unbox and review the escape room game Uyghur's Return from Puzzling Pursuits. This is a follow-up to Black Broom 1876, which was the last escape room from this company, and we're going to do this one now. If this looks fun to you, you can purchase this at the link in the description. Okay, so I'm going to summarize the back. It's been a while since we played Black Broom 1876, but basically last time we ran into the criminal Rieger Skinner, and this is the return of Rieger Skinner. So she's going to cause more mayhem, maybe? <laughs> he loves that word. Anyways, that's the outside of the box. It's for ages 14 and up, and for one to six players. We've played but we did we did the last one, and yeah. there's a hint system, right? Okay. Yeah, there's a hint system. There's a rule book. It says, read me first. Uh, we'll read it in the live stream. Okay, I'll just read the how it works okay. part. So there's going to, it's going to take anywhere from two to four hours to get through the entire game. And just like last time, there's two parts. Okay. And voila. What? Oh, it's an actual bell. Just gonna hit it. Look, yeah, yeah. Okay. it's pretty fair. So part one is this, and part two is this. And we can't show... Oh, wait, I guess we can show what's inside this Yeah, one. we can show that one. But this one is a surprise. Yeah, that one's a surprise, but... These envelopes are so easy to open. It says, and as you go through the game, you should check your answers to the puzzle. Detective. I don't think we're supposed to open them. Coach Carriage. Oh, put them in the number order. Oh, yeah. One thing I remember about this game is that it's pretty organized. So, oh, yeah. so that's number one. So there's one. number one, number two. Number three. It goes all the way to, oh, number four. Number three yeah, and number four. And that's about it in this unbox. Oh, wait. We should open this. I think this might be like the intro. Okay. Let's see. Oh, it's a cursive. I it's can a... read this. No, 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 don't read the whole thing. I read a lot of cursive. It says, in the recent months, there's been a string of peculiar occurrences in London. Oh, okay, so they think that Rieger the criminal has went to London, and now we have to catch her. That's, yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> okay. It seems like there's only four puzzles in the first half, but there might be multiple puzzles in each envelope, so I'm not know. sure. Uh, yeah, that's basically We're it. We're gonna do a live stream and come back with our final thoughts. And that is Rieger's Return from Puzzling Pursuits. My favorite puzzle was the first puzzle in part two. I can't really spoil that. Yeah, it just kind of involved wordplay. It, it was pretty clever and unique. And uh, all of, actually, all of the ones were pretty cool. There's not a specific puzzle that was my favorite, but all of them were really unique. Uh, some of them had like things that you could turn to. There was like wheels where you could turn to find the answers. Uh, as brother said, there's wordplay, there's also logic puzzles in here, and, uh, what, what else? Oh, and also kind of like, what's that, programming? Where you go like, left, and right, and forward, and back. It was like the dancing part. There's also Morse code in here. Very diverse puzzles, but they all follow, the, they all lead up to, tr you're trying to find Rieger Skinner, who's the criminal. In part one, you're on a train, and the train's about to crash into London. And your goal is basically to put brakes on the train so that you don't die. And then in part two, you're in London, and Rieger Skinner kind of, kind of, oh, she's like a criminal that's trying to have fun with you. But at the same time. Kind of like she wants to play cat and mouse with you. Is that the game? Where you get close to her tail, and then she runs away. That's kind of like provoking you. <laughs> so in part two, you're in London, and you're going from place to place trying to find her. 
Yeah. If this looks fun to you, you can purchase it at the link in the description. And we also made a live through. So if you're life playing this game too and you're stuck, you can see what we did. It's not called It took live us like. Through. Oh, did I say live through? Yeah. A live playthrough. <laughs> It took us like two hours for each part. I don't know what a life through is. Alright. And watch, the next one's gonna be called The Return of Rieger's Return. Or Rieger's Return Return. Bye! <laughs> Rieger's Return of Rieger's Return.